Okay, things are heating up at Thunder Acres. I actually been taking some heat. My fans have been texting me, messaging me, saying, hey, where is the video? Sunday fun day, and there is no new videos. On my defense, it's been like minus 20 out, 30 inches of snow, and I've been a little bit under the weather. So we're fighting fire with fire. We're making a homemade flame throwing thunder. As you can see, me and Lightning, the first trial episode didn't go so well. We got a little too close to the butterfly belt. We didn't have this rope on there. So it just things kind of heated up and you know, we weren't ready for it. In our next video, we are gonna show you step by step how to build the flame throwing thunder. What we did, we went to our local truck salvage yard. We bought three air tanks. We put two of them, cut the ends off, welded them together. Then we took and put an elbow on the bottom, put the butterfly valve in there, and our supply tank. We put 150 pounds of air in our supply tank, and then that's what blasts our fuel up. All right, the first one, we had sawdust in. We only put about two gallons in, just to see once what would happen. It went okay. What we're gonna do this time, is we're gonna take sawdust, put about 10 gallons in there, then we're gonna take coffee creamer, put about 10 gallons coffee creamer in there, and the reason we went to coffee creamer is I'll show you here. Sawdust is flammable, but coffee creamer is real flammable. So, we do things big here at Thunder Acres. So, that's why we added the coffee creamer. Then to top it off, we're gonna add a little gasoline. We're gonna add a little bit of diesel fuel. Then, we're gonna give it a snort or two, starting fluid. And then after that, we're gonna take, give it some motor oil. And then, we're gonna pull that trigger. Well, hold on a second. We're gonna take our road flares, just common road flares. We're gonna take them, and the sawdust is gonna be right to the top here. We're gonna ignite our road flares, put them in there. The idea of the road flare is, when we pull that trigger, the rope's gonna be 50 feet away. Our flares are gonna be burning. We're gonna pull the rope. 150 pounds of air is gonna shoot this sawdust creamer mixture into the air. Big old mushroom, hopefully 100 feet in the air and 50 feet wide. It's gonna smother out the road flares. Hopefully these road flares are twirling in this mushroom. Hopefully that's why I'm using three, so for sure one stays in there. Once the air mixes in with the sawdust and the creamer and the other explosive devices, the air is gonna spread it apart. Then it ain't gonna flood out the flare anymore. You're gonna get the right air fuel mixture and all of a sudden, kaboom! And then, that's when we're gonna see our 100, 150 foot flame throwing thunder. And like I said, we got all kinds of explosive. It is gonna be awesome, yeah! Thunder Acres. We're 999,500 away from our goal of 1 million subscribers. Remember on our 1,000th subscriber, some lucky guy or gal comes out and spends a half a day with us and making a video with us on Thunder Acres. And if you come over here, some people have been asking about Thunderware. We got Thunderware. We got our 20 year old legend Thunder 4x4 monster truck shirt. We got our hoodie that many of people have. We got a nice poly Thunder Acres shirt. And we got like some people say, the loud Thunder Acres shirt. We got hats and can coolers. So there you have it. Now, like I said, things are happening at Thunder Acres. Be prepared next Sunday. Things are gonna be explosive. Bring your helmet, 
bring your fire suit. Tell your mother, your brother, your sister, your uncle, your next door neighbor, things are getting big at Thunder Acres. Love y'all.